another video and today we have uh, another nerf gun review which has been a long time since we've done a nerf gun review sorry about this light um because it's a bit bright and um, look it out there and today it is a review of the star wars force awakens chewbacca bowcaster so first i'm gonna just show you it <coughs> here is it with the um ammo clip and with the screws and this is for the brand new Star Wars Force Awakens movie which comes out this Christmas this year 2015 Christmas and it in um, England it retails for £25 I got it like a few weeks ago and first we're gonna go on the dark so it comes with five exclusive Star Wars Force Awakens bullets and it has the Star Wars logo with the Rebellion symbol with a uh, transparent green tip and then once it had the Rebellion logo and the Nerf logo. It comes with five of them and they're exclusive to this gun I think so far. And it comes with a detachable scope here and it all looks like a binoculars and you can look through it so it's not blocked or anything. And it does have a regular tactical rail service for fitting on any other tactical rail systems or nerf guns. And any other end strike attachment would attach to this. But unlike regular nerf guns on the tactical rails, it has a bigger orange bit, which is a bit weird, but who cares? And as you can see, the stock is really small. If I hold it out like that, it goes up to there, not even half my arm. And it does have a bandolier strap right there and right at the front of the gun. But if you see on that side, it's fully solid and there's little grips on the back. And then if you turn to this side of the stock, it looks pretty bad because you can see inside of it and it's hollow. So you probably could break easy the stock, but when you put it on, you can't take it out. It touches in that point and at the handle. And it does say Star Wars there, and Star Wars there, and <coughs> the ammo clip just fell off, and it does fall off quite easily. And if I take it off, it's like a proper ammo clip, but it only goes into this gun. This gun has two holes, and this gun, ammo clip has two pegs. But if I take it off, you can see there's like, like button sort of stuff here, and it's pretty cool. And it has it on both sides, and bow arms are not like the crossfire bow once like the crossfire bow once you put it on you can't take it off this piece may look like a uh, it was detached but it's actually already attached and it can't come off and this is how it shoots so take up the here's the string you pull it back and make sure it's all the way down there put in a bullet and then just pull the trigger. But sometimes the gun might not fire properly and it would the dart would just go out and not go very far. And it says this gun should shoot 20 metres long. So now we're going to get in with the firing test. So move the camera down a little bit if I can. So there's the sofa. We're going to see if it can hit the wall. That's less than 20 metres. If it can hit the wall, it probably can hit 20 metres. Here we go. See, that's what I meant by when it wiggles. Sometimes it will do that. See, it just done it again. I right. think it will work better if you hold it straight. No, it's not hitting the door. It usually works pretty well. There we go, hit the door. So now we're going to get on with the ratings for the gun. See you in a sec. So now, guys, we're going to get on with the overall ratings for the gun. For the darts, I rate 10 out of 10 because they're pretty neat designs. And 
for the performance, the shooting, probably a seven because they sometimes do wiggle. And for the looks, ten out of ten because I love this gun. But you guys might have different opinions. It's our own opinions what we think. And yeah, the other Star Wars Force Awakens guns that you can get made by Hasbro and the awesome Nerf is the. Uh, first source order stormtrooper blaster, which is basically a rampage with a pump with a white 12 round rag, which is here in England about £40. And the other, the final gun is the first order stormtrooper blaster pistol, and it, um, it and they come with uh, red bullets, and yeah, and it retails for. Thirteen pounds, and yes, it comes with the red stormtrooper darts, and you can get dark refill packs, which are about about ten pounds, with eighteen darts, eight nine of them with the Republic blue bullets, and then the other nine are red, like stormtrooper imperial bullets. So I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.